Alright guys, today I'm gonna be showing you into the magical world of Xpex. I'm gonna be teaching you how to make it the dank GFX. Alright, so the first thing you're gonna need is to make the file. Now, depending on what you're gonna do, you're gonna need different dimensions. I'm gonna make a Twitter header, so I need 1500 by 500, resolution 300. I do 300 personally, you can do 72, it really doesn't matter. Okay, now the next thing you're gonna wanna do is choose a color. Um, I'm feeling like a period blood red today and just to fill that in just use alt delete fill that in automatically All right Next thing you're gonna want to do is choose your secondary color and just kind of draw all over it. You know make your make it your own Oh, yeah, look at that. You just really want to personalize it. You know make it your own make sure everyone knows This is yours and you made this All right Next thing you're gonna want to do is add a nice collage of pictures in the background I, I had a picture of a black dick I wanted to use because I thought it'd be funny But I just realized I can't show that on YouTube Okay, so the next thing we're gonna do is instead go to Google and look for pictures to use like for a montage in the background and personally you know when it comes to pictures I just kind of choose things that personally I like you know as I said personalize it make it your own so yeah I just kind of choose things that I would like in you know my banner all right guys so now that you have you know the dank pictures you want in your background for kind of like a collage to personalize it you want to add some extra little effects and maybe even make the pictures bigger if you need to I don't know maybe we can add a nice little background you know we can take this picture of Hitler bring it to the back just make it really really just humongous there we go just really emphasize the Hitler and then just maybe turn on the opacity just a little bit but enough so you can tell it's him. Actually, let's get his face in the picture too. All right, there we go. I think that's pretty good. All right, so now that you've finished your dank GFX, you need to add a watermark. So personally, what I like to do is just put like designed by or made by and then my name, just like that. Because you see, if you don't put a watermark, someone could steal your dank designs. Almighty Lord Satan, by whom all things are set free, I cast myself utterly into thine arms and place myself unreservedly under thy all-powerful protection. Comfort me and deliver me from all of hindrances and snares of those who wish to harm me, both seen and unseen. Visit justice and vengeance upon those who seek my destruction. Render them powerless and devastated. Direct their malice to return upon them tenfold and to destroy them who would resent my being. Fill my soul with thy invincible power. Strengthen me and I may preserve in my service and act as an agent of thy works and a vessel of thy will. This I ask in your name, almighty ineffable Lord Satan who liveth and reigneth forevermore. Sorry about that. Thought I'd say a quick prayer real quick to make sure no one steals my dank GFX.